Well, a ruckus has been visible outside the Haryana Vidhan Sabha during the budget session where the Congress MLAs are continuously protesting against the government highlighting several issues. And in fact, you can see they are having the play cards in their hands and even highlighting certain issues. It's like unemployment, corruption, uh, SAC Minister Sandeep Singh and OPS. These are the prominent issues that has been highlighted by the Congress MLAs here. You can see the visuals that how they are showing the play cards to all the ministers and the government MLAs by standing outside the Haryana Vidhan Sabha and lodging their protest and in fact they have walked they have done a march to Vidhan Sabha by protesting all the Congress MLAs inside and outside both ways creating ruckus and in fact protesting against the BJP government in Haryana you can see you can see the visuals and even the, and and even Bhupendra Singh Hudda is also Bhupendra Singh Hudda is also speaking Regarding the issues, we will try to track. The member is also the power of the whole panchayat. And the OPS Karamchari will be made a committee. What do you want to make a committee? This is the decision. Do you want to make an old pension or not? As we have said, our government will come on the first day. We will make an old pension. In this way, the old pension is the old pension. The old pension is the old pension. It is 60 years old. They will retire and they will not be able to fight against the government. This is an undemocratic thing. How can they fight against the government? They can't fight against the government, they can't fight against the government. You can see any decision. And the government is not looking at the government. And the government is crossing 4 lakhs in the liability. Where will the country go? The government is going to go. दबाई रही है आपको देख रहे हैं दबाई नहीं देखा कितनी दौड़ से हमने कहा हमने ये कहा कि भाई मॉरल ग्राउंड्स लोग तो देना चाहिए या सीबीआई की इंक्वायरी करो या हाई कोर्ट के जज का इंक्वायरी करो इसमें क्या इनको संकोच है जब उनकी पार्टी नहीं अपनी उसमें बुला रही है उसको हाँ संसदीय बैठ तो यहाँ क्या मतलब कैबिनेट में और वो क्यों नहीं आ रहे वो क्यों नहीं आ रहे सर आज आएंगे नहीं पूरे सेशन में नहीं हटाएंगे तो हम भी नहीं हटाएंगे प्रदर्शन अब अंदर भी चलेगा सर बाहर जिस तरह आप लोग कर रहे हैं सदन के अंदर भी सदन के सदन को बताएंगे आपको आप यहाँ जो हमारे जो जो मुद्दे लेके चल रहे हैं आपके सामने है बेरोजगारी का मुद्दा है महंगाई का मुद्दा है भ्रष्टाचार का मुद्दा है कानून व्यवस्था का मुद्दा है कानून व्यवस्था की नाम चीज में प्रदेश में है ही नहीं जैसे सरकार ही नहीं है नू की बात करें नू में जो देखिये देखिये मैंने स्वयं कहा था उसमें की उसकी जाँच निष्पक्ष हो हाई कोर्ट के जज की सुपरविजन में सी बी आई करे और दोषी को छोड़ा ना जाए तो बिल्कुल आप देख रहे हैं कि ये भूपेंद्र सिंह गुप्ता थे उदय बंदी क्या कहेंगे? तो मैं तो इस बात से निष्पक्ष जांच मांग रहा हूँ भाई। जांच में जो भी आएगा दोषी हो उसको सजा कड़ी सजा मिलनी चाहिए। गुड्डा साहब ये सारे इश्यूज जो है विधानसभा के अंदर भी उठाएंगे उठाए हैं कल भी उठाए थे आज भी उठाएंगे फिर उठाए उठाते रहेंगे हम लोगों की हमारे लोगों ने हमारे को विपक्ष में भेज रखा है तो हमारी अपने अपनी जिम्मेवारी निभाएंगे जोर शोर से आवाज उठाएंगे लोगों की जो आज लोगों की आवाज है उसका उठाना हमारा काम है और साथ में तुम्हारा भी काम है लेकिन सीएम साहब कह रहे हैं की ओपीएस पॉसिबल नहीं है क्यों नहीं है जब हिमाचल में ओपीएस हो गया राजस्थान में हो गया छत्तीसगढ़ में हो गया दिल्ली में हो गया पंजाब में हो गया तो यहाँ क्या नहीं क्या इम्पोसिबल है सर कल निर्मला सीतारमण का एक बयान सर उनको ज्ञान नहीं है ये फैसला हुआ था अटल बिहारी जी की सरकार में ठीक है वो फिर स्टेटो ने अडोप्ट किया था और जब तजर्बा हो गया भाई ठीक नहीं है मांग करे ये वहाँ राजस्थान में किसने लागू करी थी बीजेपी ने लागू करी थी ना कौन सी सरकार है हटा दी इसी प्रकार से जब एक वो सोलर पे पे आज जब मांग है कि कर्मचारियों की मांग नहीं चाहिए ताकि उनके भविष्य सुरक्षित हो नहीं मैं मैं कई दफा कह चुका कई दफा कह चुका कि उनकी एसआईटी बैठी है देखो एक तो एसआईटी आई टी अगर मानवी सी बी आई जाँच कराए 
can see that Bhupendra Singh Hooda is highlighting several issues and in fact the protest is still continued outside the Vidhan Sabha. We are joining with that Kiran Chaudhary also. We will speak to her. Ma'am, what are the issues you are going to highlight and what is the demand for this protest? Issues are multiple and today we see that on the ground the government is absolutely a complete failure to be honest. Yeah, this uh, karamcharis, jo hai, they are on the streets and the way they are being treated by that very government whom they helped to come in power, I think is not really good at all. But Chief Minister has clearly mentioned that OPS is not at all possible in Haryana. Well, I would say that just because it's going to be a very big financial burden to the exchequer, the pensions are being cut is a wrong uh, stand because you see these people have their entire, they have given their entire life in the service of the state. and. You know, today in today's times, even uh, people, younger children do not look after the older ones. And at a time when they have retired and they are old, uh, old and they need such, uh, sustenance and they need support, they don't have anything in their pockets. I think it's really a bad uh, uh, thing to do. And frankly speaking, these very people, I mean, the, the mere fact that they say it's going to be a big burden on the exchequer, is the wrong way of looking at it. If you are going to not look after your human resource, how the hell are you going to have any kind of development for the future? That is the main thing. Your own people you are not looking after. Just because you mean to say you are going to do development at the cost of your own people, I think that's really sad. Thank you. So, in fact, you can see that Congress MLAs are protesting against the government with the demand of revival of the OPS, sacked Minister Sandeep Singh, highlighting the corruption issues and even the unemployment issues as well. And the protest is still continued outside the Vidhan Sabha and Bhupendra Singh Hutta, LOP of Haryana Assembly, says that he will definitely take up the issue inside the Assembly also. Well, we are, we are slipping into a very short break, but stay tuned for the more stories on the other side. Stay tuned to Republic.